got good form. Cullen's putting his Templar training to good use. Did Cullen tell you he was a Templar? He's not wearing the armor. He didn't have to. Might not be a Templar shield, but it's a Templar holding it. He angles the shield just a bit down. Helps direct fire or acid away, so it doesn't spray right into your face. Kanari learned the same thing when we trained to fight to Vinter Mages. Your Templar's doing good work. I'm impressed by what Cullen has accomplished with the troops. Damn right. It takes time to build a group into a team, but he's got their loyalty. Now he just needs them to make a decent shield wall, and they'll be good to go. Biggest problem for the Inquisition right now isn't on the front line. It's at the top. You've got no leader, no Inquisitor. The Inquisition has done all right so far without an Inquisitor. That's because all we've needed so far is damage control, reaction. A group can handle that. Once you've sealed the breach, it's gonna be time to make decisions. Someone's gonna have to step up. Ah, who knows? Maybe you seal the breach. The Chantry gets off its ass and all those soldiers go home and get fat. You think? It could happen. It won't. But it could. How's it going? So how did you get the name Iron Bull? I picked it. We don't have names under the queue. Just... I don't know. Job descriptions, I guess. When I came to Orlay, I chose the Iron Bull for myself. Why specifically Iron Bull? This may surprise you, but I really like hitting things. Also, it's THE Iron Bull, technically. I like having an article at the front. It makes it sound like I'm not even a person, just a mindless weapon. An implement of destruction. That really works for me. I'd like to know more about your work with the Ben Hasrath. Ben Hasrath is actually a general term. You've got the secret police who investigate problems inside our territory. You've got the re-educators who take people with problems and fix their minds. Or make them disappear. And then you've got the spies. How do the re-educators work? Well, I only know the basics. Wasn't my area. That said, keep a man awake long enough, ask the right questions, give the right potions, and you can get him to say anything. You don't need blood magic or demons to change someone's mind. We're a lot more fragile than we'd like to believe. You can alter someone's beliefs that easily. One of my friends was a re-educator. He said that every memory is like the page of a book. When you examine a memory, you're turning to that page. And when you're there, the page is laid bare. Write a few notes in the margins of the page. Erase a word here and there. And your whole outlook changes. I always felt a little weird reading after that conversation. And you're a spy? Close. I am now, I suppose. But that's not how I started. They sent me to Saharan because they needed someone who could fight and hunt down problems. That whole island was a sack of cats. Incursions from Tevinta, Talvashath, and native rebels fighting both sides. And in the middle, me. Trying to wrangle the rebels and restore order. You seem like the type who enjoys a good fight. There's a good fight, and there's finding out who put rat poison in the bread and killed a bunch of children. I hunted down a lot of rebels, lost a lot of friends to the Vince, or the Fog Warriors, or the Talvashoth. One day I woke up and couldn't think of a damned reason to keep doing my job. Turned myself into the re-educators. Not many people would have the courage to do that. I thought about letting some rebel kill me. But I couldn't give any of those bastards the satisfaction. The Ben Hasrath ordered me to go to Orlay, ostensibly as a Talvashoth, and work undercover. That's how I ended up here. I'm glad you're here, Bull. Me too. If you ever need to talk more about all this, let me know. 
Nah, it was a long time ago. Thanks, though. So if we get better horses, you think that'll make a difference? Master Janet's horses in the hitlands are faster and stronger. Make a look at it. So much easier to ignore when it's far away. And to actually walk out of it, to be that close. If I hadn't been saved by Inquisition soldiers, I don't know what would have happened. Inquisition soldiers? That's not what I've heard. I have to admit, I thought you'd be... Human. Yes. Being up front is better than knife fear. It was a foolish thought. Should have known better than to say anything. It's what you do and how you do it that's important. Just one question then. How do you think you fit in with all this? I just want to help stop the war. Try to put things back in order. A worthy goal, one I'm happy to support. For me, I'll be satisfied so long as we find the bastards that killed the Divine. They owe us some answers.